today we're going to freeze dry some blueberries. They are in season, so bigger boxes are really cheap. Um, I've taken a bunch out. I've washed them already. I dried them a little bit. There's a little bit of water still left on it. Um, that's, that's okay. It's best to have it totally dry, but it will still do a, a fine job. Uh, we've lined our tray with parchment paper so the blueberries don't stick. Just from Costco. Uh, so with blueberries, they're super easy. There's no prep other than just washing. We're just going to load them onto the tray. We're going to want to have it all... Whoop, no overlapping. Spread it all out. So uh, one thing I have found with any thing that has a peel that goes all the way around it freezes a lot uh, slower than fruit that was pre-cut that doesn't have a peel surrounding the whole thing so this will take a lot longer dry time I am going to be putting it into the freeze dryer with some other fruit that has a lesser length of time for freeze drying required so I'll pull those fruits out when it's all finished and we'll be adding extra time for this one so we're down at the freeze dryer here. The cooling system has uh, brought it down to a proper temperature. It takes about 15 minutes. So as you look at the screen here, it says to load the food and ensure the drain valve is closed. So if you look over here, this is the drain valve. It is indeed closed. So we can open up the door and place the blueberries in. So when the blueberries are finished, um, or when the machine is finished, I am going to check the blueberries and add extra dry time to it. Close it and press start. So the blueberries are all finished. Uh, the total dry and freeze time, it took 33 hours. As you can see, there's a lot of little crystallization. The first time I did the blueberries, um, I thought that was still wet, so I kept running it and it's totally fine. So if you wanna check your blueberries um, after the dry time is finished and just make sure they're all crunchy. You can't break these ones apart as much. You can kind of squish it and it goes into like powder form. When you eat it, it's very crunchy. It's really good, it tastes like little candies. Kids love them. Um, so it took a lot longer dry time because of the skin that surrounds the whole berry. If it was sliced, it would cut down on the dry time, but obviously to cut blueberries in half is extremely time consuming versus just running it for an extra couple hours. And we'd be packing into some Mylar bags, but we're going camping. So I'm just putting it in a little Tupperware because we're gonna eat them probably tonight and tomorrow.